we have lift off. Who doesn't live for the Chanel runway shows? They are without doubt the most exciting and this season Karl Lagerfeld didn't disappoint as he sent us blasting off to space with the launch of his fall 2017 collection, once again proving that your imagination is the only limit when it comes to fashion. This mega show had models strutting down the spaceship themed runway that even featured an actual rocket ship in the middle of the stage. Was this Lagerfeld telling us that this collection was about to be out of this world? Yes it was as the models started strutting their stuff down the runway showcasing the designs that featured metlics, jackets with a space blanket feel and glittery silver boots with a steel cap toe, moon boots anyone? We'll take 10. Sequin covered headbands and rocket ship bags topped it off giving this collection a galactic feel. To close the show the rocket took off with its jets glowing and blowing smoke concluding that Chanel once again wins, all for the dramatic effect. For Demog Vesalia's FW17 collection this designer continued his fascination with oversized, dramatic figures, and we don't know about you but we are here for it. Being the house's 100th anniversary most of these pieces played on untouched bale and Shaga Couture as a salute to its legacy instead adding a few tweaks and inflating silhouettes and shapes. Injecting his own twist Gvesalia's highlights were the printed logos on shoes, asymmetric fastenings on outerwear and futuristic sunglasses which screamed upcoming street style trend. Meanwhile, an array of sweaters that were paired with couture showpieces and high, vibrant boots added a pop of color. Let's talk about that headgear. Rick Owens showcased his latest collection with his army of models who were decked out in impromptu headdresses. Elsewhere, there were walking balloon suits and brutalist applications of leather. Puffer jackets wrapped around and sneakers were abnormally high in a compelling way. We love the cool, wearable vibes this collection is giving off. Not one to disappoint, Owens always knows how to put on a show. Minimal is where it's at for H&M. With such big name models including the Hardeed sisters, at Woa Boa and Winnie Harlow walking the runway there was no question that this collection is one that's going to be a hit with the younger generation. Held at the iconic Tennis Club de Paris, H&M showcased their latest collection's minimal designs to a star-studded audience such as Nicki Minaj and Alexa Chung, while The Weeknd performed live making this quite the show. A handful of menswear looks were also featured throughout which was a first for this retailer's usual runway showing subtle symbolism. Pierpaolo Piccioli's Valentino collection showed us that art should be lived and not just looked at. Focusing on dresses, this collection featured little to no skin as many looks were high necked and long sleeves with an A-line silhouette that hid any trace of a curve. The collection boasted airy silks, prints and elegant colors long coats and edgy boots. Each outfit was paired with a red beaded necklace that featured a golden charm hanging down making this the perfect runway ready outfit. 50 Shades of Blue at the Or. The inspiration for Maria Grazia Churi's second women's collection for Dior was the color blue. The show notes explained that it was one of Christian Dior's favorite hues and included this line from his 1954 book The Little Dictionary of Fashion. Among all the colors, navy blue is the only one which can ever compete with black, it has all the same qualities. Turi explored a wide range of blue hues on the runway while there were splashes of black and gold throughout the show. Another key trend that seemed to rule this runway was the use of berets as every look was topped off with a leather beret as seen on front row muses Rihanna and Kate Moss. Some of the standout looks included a chunky blue cable knit sweater, paired with a delicate degrade tulle skirt, a range of blue velvet pieces which is obviously a major trend this season, some with embroidered lily flower designs and a double-breasted navy blue tailored jacket with lapels that continued past the shoulder blades. Reappearing were the waistbands with logos, jackets and straps from Cherry's debut collection with the addition of monogamy bags, it's survival of the fittest. Walking to Nirvana's Smells Like Teen Spirit, 
Gigi Hadid opened this season's Balmain show wearing a fringed skirt and gold striped lips which seemed to be a theme for all the models. Gold, brown, bronze, caramels and black filled designer Oliver Ousting's palette as he mixed heavy metal rock motifs and jewel encrusted jackets and gowns. Head to toe monochrome knits and various textures and cuts were all featured throughout this show as was fur jackets, count zebra printed pants and crocodile print giving viewers major jungle fever.